Good afternoon. Allotment holders in Gloucestershire have lost their year-long fight to save their plots. Campaigners claim the site at Coombe in Wooden Under Edge is the oldest in the country and they tried to buy it, but the land is private. Earlier we spoke to our reporter, Michelle Ruminski. Amanda, you join us on Coombe Allotments on what is an absolutely glorious day, perfect growing conditions to help the fruit and veg here. But very sadly, tomorrow this will no longer be an allotment and it's because the landowner wants to take back this land into her own ownership. And this has upset quite a few local people, some who've basically worked on this land for several decades. Let's speak to Martin. Um, Martin, why have you campaigned so hard to keep this land for you and the other allotment holders? There's a number of reasons. The, the prime one is that this is our community meeting space. It's our village green, if you like, and it's fulfilled that function since the Industrial Revolution. This was a, a hub of the woolen industry in this village, and uh, people have always used it to meet, to dry their clothes, to dry their wool, to dry their cloth, and to grow vegetables and fruit. Uh, most of the cottages around here have only got small gardens, if any, and uh, they needed this space, and that's why we're, we've been fighting it for a year. Well, the landowner, Susan Ballinger, um, hasn't responded to our request um, to do an interview with us today, but um, she has told the BBC in the past um, that she's basically acting within her own rights to take, to take possession of this property. Um, she says she's given the allotment holders a year's grace to make other arrangements. And she also pointed out to us that um, she says that you all own gardens yourselves where you could grow vegetables. Um, some people would say she has acted quite reasonably. Um, what would you say? Do you think she has? I think we've tried to, uh, we've tried to engage with the landowner um, ten times and failed. Um, as far as we know, she's not been on this site. Uh, it's, it's particularly sad. There's nothing illegal happened, uh, either on our side or on her side. Um, and we don't question her right to um, evict us. Never have done. But we actually think it's morally wrong. Martin, thank you for joining us. And as Martin says, they are going out with a bang. They are having a bit of a party here today. Um, really hoping not to be too disappointed by that decision. And um, who knows what will happen for the future. Michelle, thank you.